Welcome to the Blockchain Report. We discuss all things blockchain technology, digital assets, DeFi, NFTs, and much more. Today's video, we are diving into the Story Protocol's live testnet, the Iliad testnet. This just launched a few days ago, and they did have an NFT mint for the first 48 hours, and unfortunately i well fortunately i was able to get that minted myself but unfortunately i wasn't able to get this video done in time to get it out to you i did highlight this in my discord which you all should check out but um we'll dive into that later but i wanted to touch on this there's some other nfts or another commemorative nft you can mint there's a faucet page and a staking page so we'll dive into all that and more and before we get started thank you so much for joining please like subscribe comment share this out to anyone you think would be interested in blockchain technology all the fun stuff we get to learn and cool rewards we earn along the way and i don't know if story is an incentivized test net but you do have some cool uh, if you were able to mint this first story ip asset story protocol is the world's intellectual property blockchain and here they have a color nft marketplace which is the first ip marketplace only possible with story and you can mint that here but in the discord get in there get the alpha we drop it as soon as it happens even if we can't cover this particular portion on the YouTube channel, it's being shared in the Discord. We have a lot of amazing people in the community that can help get you the best alpha. And I appreciate all of you who are in there. And to those of you who are new, welcome and let's get into it. So Story Testnet, they had this uh, Iliad commemorative mint, which is over now. So congratulations to those of you who were able to mint that now. So this is for builders looking to solve real problems. You can apply to Story Academy, their full service accelerator and incubator for new and established projects if you're interested in that. Here's some ecosystem partners, Layer Zero, Block Scout, Zeta Chain, Redstone, all these, Lens, Tomo, Orb, some DeFi, AI, and creator platforms. And so what you can do is come to the Story Twitter, but you can come here to the color MP and scroll down to colormp.com forward slash launchpad and you can mint your NFT there. But first we can go to story.foundation or the story protocol Twitter, go to the link tree and then you can find their website story.foundation or down below you can go to the faucet and the faucet will give you, I think one IP per day. So that's any, uh, anything verify browser and all you have to do is copy your wallet paste it right here firm that you are not a computer and claim one ip i claimed mine within 24 hours okay so mine resets in one hour so that way or so then i've got my nft or my tokens my testnet tokens so i can mint the nft and let's check out make sure yeah see i own three activity it, it was working really slow the other day. So keep that in mind when you're participating in this. Testnet is kind of slow. So you'll mint and then you can trade your NFTs right here. And if you want to sell yours, just go here to my collection, click on one of these list for sale. We will do two, see if that works. I think we're getting an error. We listed successfully. So mint a couple or a handful, I would suggest, and that way you can mint or and sell one. And then we can close out of here, <clears throat> go back to apps. You can check out the Explorer, but I would suggest go to staking and we can go on sale. This might take a little while for it to catch up. So you can close out of the color marketplace. This is the staking page. This is the Explorer. You can connect your wallet down here on the bottom left and see if there's any interactions we can do on here iliad switch to the iliad iliad network okay nothing really you just check in your stuff but we'll come here to the staking page you'll choose what validator bum 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 and i know this i think i had to do this on firefox i don't think it worked on on metamask i mean uh on brave let's see let's try this again so we're gonna put, let's see if this works. Doesn't look like we've gotten anything good, but this is where you're supposed to stake your assets. I was able to do this the other day, but it, it's very, very rough. So when you see the validators here, you're gonna wanna click on one and it'll, sh it'll take you through a whole thing on how to stake, but this is just not working. Let me check their Discord, see if there's any issues. Nope, 
But this is where you stake. I would suggest staking some in this page. It's not really working well for me right now. So we're just gonna skip that and try again later. So check it out. I think there's more to come. Oh, I know there's more to come but just keep an eye out for story protocol. They got a lot of stuff coming down the line and if we can get this to work, that would be great. But either way, I hope this was informative for you. I know that <clears throat> I promise I get stuff out faster on Discord than I do here. So get in the Discord. It's amazing, amazing, amazing. That'll be it for this video. I appreciate you all so, so much. And remember, Jump in the Discord. Jump in the Discord. Get in there and we will see you there. But with that, this is the Blockchain Report. Have a wonderful day, homies. Peace.